guys, so I'm going to start this video out on a serious note. This is pretty serious, and it's a commentary video on Twitch. And Twitch has made a lot of mistakes in the past few days. So I'm expecting most of you guys to know what Twitch is, which is in a streaming platform. And there's many categories for streamers to use. And for this one specifically, it relates to Ninja and Fortnite. And uh, currently, as we're recording this, Fortnite is the second most viewed channel right now. And so the story goes on as Ninja moves on to Mixer, which is a different streaming platform. And basically what Twitch has done is taken advantage of his, um, as his move to the different platform, and they're using it to advertise different channels when people search Ninja on Twitch. To go along with this, when you could search Ninja and different Fortnite streamers popped up, there was a time when adult content was shown on his page for at least two hours, as the source says, and that is just so disturbing how Twitch put that there. It, not instantly, but it just like it was there for two hours, and that is so long, especially being recommended to his audience. So overall, my thoughts on that is I'm just honestly mad at Twitch for doing that. First of all, they were showing other streamers when you searched him up, but I'm pretty sure they removed it by now. And then there was adult content being streamed, shown on his page for hours, which is just not acceptable. And my thoughts overall on this ninja situation with Twitch is, man, I just want to kind of leave Twitch forever now. So moving on to a different topic, this still has to do with Twitch, but apparently there are streamers, specifically female streamers, saying racial slurs and getting away with it with no punishment, not even the lowest punishment that Twitch can give. And at the same time, there are other streamers, specifically male streamers, when they stream, sometimes it sounds like they say something, but it's really not what it sounds like. So to prove my point here, there are some like male streamers, such as Tifu, because one time when he was in a game in Fortnite, there was a skin that looked like a raccoon, and he said Hoon, and apparently that got him banned because he said the skin looked like a raccoon, which does not make any sense. But on the other hand, when there's a female streamer saying a racial slur, they don't get any punishment. So specifically, there are two female streamers I'm going to mention in this video. So my first one is Alinity. So not only has she said a racial slur not that long ago, but she has done multiple mistakes on Twitch and not been punished for one. Like a few weeks ago, or even a few days ago, I can't really remember, but Alinity threw a cat over her chair, as in that's animal abuse, and Twitch did nothing about it. And literally a few days ago, Alinity said a racial slur. Like, she cannot get away with this, and Twitch didn't even punish her. And this just proves one thing on Twitch. Twitch is sexist. Sub to my channel so that I can, um... How about this? Yeah. Can you say something in my channel so I can give you a sub? And yeah. then... and But now Bruh. Prime is in the channel, okay? And to go on with this, there's another female streamer who goes by the name Amarith, who has said a racial slur a few days ago on Twitch while she was streaming in front of an audience, and she has not received the punishment or got banned from the racial slur that she said, and this, this just makes Twitch look bad because male streamers who say stuff that sounds like stuff get banned either way, even if they didn't say anything. And then there's these female streamers, if it sounds like they said something, or they did, they still get away. Aki on the ethnic aisle? I guess there's a or two now, Ramane, on some ethnic aisle. So overall, my thoughts on Twitch right now is, I do not want to go on Twitch anymore. They're making horrible decisions, and the fact that they let go of Ninja and use him for advertising other streamers, with even at one point, adult content being streamed, which is not allowed on the website by the way, for hours, being shown to fans, 
If they didn't know he was on Mixer, they would check on Twitch, they would see that. And then to add on to this, the female streamers saying racial slurs, get away with it, no punishments, and then male streamers on the other hand, even if it, they didn't say anything, but it sounds like it, they, they get banned either way. And this is just not fair. It kind of just proves Twitch is sexist. And it kind of makes me think that Twitch has females working at Twitch and they're kind of just being feminist, to be honest, because they're just keeping with their gender and banning the opposite gender for different reasons than the female streamers. And this is just horrible. And honestly, Twitch has been exposed. And if we can start a hashtag, hashtag Twitch is canceled in the comments below, spread it across YouTube, and hopefully Twitch can address something. But for now, I am done with Twitch, and I hope you guys understand what they did. And really, that's a lot of bad stuff they did. And if you like to see more commentary videos like this one, Please subscribe to my channel and hashtag Twitch is cancelled. I will see you guys later. Bye. Oh man.